PentoML is a Python open source library that enables users to create a machine learning powered prediction service in minutes. In the previous video, we learned how to containerize your bentos and deploy to Heroku. But if we want our managers and stakeholders to try out the model, it can be a good idea to build a simple UI for our API using Streamlit. First, we will create a title for our app and I'll use Streamlit title for that. And I will call my app Customer Segmentation Web App. Next, let's create Streamlit app using what we got so far and we will click on the link and you will see something like that now let's add some forms so users can insert the information about their customer start with an empty dictionary then add a form that take only number and the first argument is the name of the form mean value is the minimum value that users allow to use step specifies how much the value will increase when they click the increase button value specifies the default value and help give users some hint on what this form is about now when users type in their input it will be saved into the keyword income in our dictionary okay let's do the same thing with the rest of the columns that we need from users cool now let's save this and refresh our app to see how it looks like so far we can see that there are multiple forms for the information that we need and now we can type in a different values or increase a value using the plus button so that's pretty convenient but we lack the submit button let's add the submit button to our code to add a button simply use streamlit dog button and the message on top of the button which is get the cluster of this customer okay so we will see a button if we go back to the website so when we done with our information we can click the button here now what we want is when people click the button all the data will be used by request in order to get the prediction from our app let's write the code to do that so the code under the if statement will only run when the button is clicked we also want to check to make sure that every values are inserted. Currently our data is a dictionary, let's turn it into a JSON file. And we will use this data to request the prediction from our API. So everything is similar to what we saw previously and the data will be data JSON. And we'll take the value of the response cool now to tell your users what is the predicted value let's write the output using streamlit write now let's refresh our app and see if this code works cool we can see that after clicking the button we know that the information about the customer that we submitted belongs to the cluster zero now this app is more intuitive to play with you have just learned how to create API endpoints for your machine learning model using Bento ML. With Bento ML, your teammates can use your model without setting up an environment or messing with your code. How cool is that? I regularly post about concepts and tools for best data science practices. Subscribe to my channel for more content like this.